Hello student, welcome to this video. This is lecture number 30. We already covered the 29 lecture for solving the supplementary problem of the books vector analysis by Mr. Spiegel book. And you know this is a very important book for physics honors as well as for mathematics honors. And this is important for the IIT jump preparation. That's why we decided to solve the supplementary problem of this book. In this video, you want to solve the supplementary problem 4.91 to 4.94 of the chapter 4, which consists the gradient, divergence, and curl. So go to the question directly 4.91. What is this is evaluate curl of this r vector by r square equals to zero. So if you know the vector identity, which is nothing but curl of phi a, what is the value of curl of phi a? That is the grad phi curl a minus no plus phi curl of a. Here, here we can say phi is nothing but 1 by r square and uh, a vector is r vector. So we can say grad 1 by r square cross r vector plus phi means 1 by r square curl of r. Okay. So this is you know the uh, gradient, gradient of any uh, function of f r r is nothing but a prime r into r cap. Okay. So R cap can be written as prime R that is 2 by R cube. Um, R cap can be written as R vector by N cross R plus 1 by R square curl of R. You all know the R cross R is 0. So this will be 0 and curl of R also 0. The curl of R is 0 is proved in the previous lecture. If you don't know, you can see the previous lecture whose description in given in the whose link is given in the description box. Go to the next question. 4.92 for what value the constant a uh, will be a vector a vector have its curl identical zero uh, uh, identical equal to zero that means this a vector a x y minus z q i cap plus a minus 2 x s q j cap plus 1 minus a x z square k cap okay so what is the value of curl a curl a means i cap j cap k cap copy uh, del del x del del y del del z and this is the a x y minus z q this is the a minus 2 x s q and this is the 1 minus a x z square so this is i cap del del y of this there is no y so this will be 0 del del z of this this also be 0 j cap uh, del del z of this this is minus 3 z square and del del x of this this is minus 1 minus a z square plus k cap del del s of this this is 3 x square a minus 2 minus del del y of this this is the a x del del y so this is a x okay is this okay this is x square okay okay so this will be 2 x and you can say this is z cap 3 z square minus minus z square this is minus 4 z square plus a z square plus k cap this is 2 4 2x minus x 4x minus 2x minus a that means plus a x 2a 2a x minus 4x minus 4x plus a x okay so this will be 0 if we get this is 0 or this is 0 so minus 4 plus a into x equals to 0 so we can say value of a is 4 okay so the value of a is 4 go to the next question prove curl of phi grad phi is 0 so curl means del cross phi grad phi so use the previous identity which is says that curl of phi a is nothing but grad phi cross a plus phi of curl a so here grad phi 
call a vector is grad phi also phi curl of phi a you know grad phi cross grad phi is zero and curl of grad phi is also zero so this will be zero hence proved go to the next question graph the uh, vector uh, vector fields a vector and b vector uh, you know <coughs> we first at first we want to plot the a vector x i cap plus y j cap you can see the vector the plot can be written as <coughs> just take some eight points suppose you 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 see at uh, any x <coughs> any x there is a y zero so y zero is so this is along i cap minus x this is along minus i cap if y x equal to zero at y point this is j cap this is okay similarly at this where suppose this is one one so i cap plus j cap i cap plus j cap so resultant will be along that direction similarly here is minus i minus i my uh, x is minus so x is uh, minus i so along the direction and y is plus that so resultant will be that similarly resultant will be that so the this this field is like that the outward direction okay this a vector plot if you plot this this is a outward direction and this plot is already given in the spiral book in chapter one in the first chapter you can see this plot is given then <coughs> compute the divergence so if we want to find out the divergence of a divergence of a that is del del x of that is del del x of coefficient of i cap that is x plus del del y of coefficient of j cap that is y so 1 plus 1 that is 2 so divergence a is 2 divergence of a is 2 means uh, that is the positive value so this is a source field this call be a source field or source field point that means the field is outward okay so it can supply field from a point what is the value of curl of a curl of a means i cap j cap k cap this is del del x del del y del del z and a coefficient of a e x y and this will be zero so i cap this is zero this is zero plus j cap uh, j cap del del z del del zero 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 plus k cap um, del del y del del zero Hmm. X Y hmm. Del del Y of zero zero. So this will be zero. That means this is a e rotational vector. E rotational. E rotational vector. Uh, source field means that means this is a non solenoidal. Non solenoidal. Okay and this is irrotational that means this is not rotational you can say this is the outward field outward field this is the outward field go to the next question graph the vector uh, okay okay uh, just take the b vector second one which is y i cap minus x j cap okay so for draw this vector uh, i taken the point when x is 0 when x is 0 when x is 0 when x is 0 that is along no, sorry in this point y is 0 if y is 0 some x values is a minus minus j cap minus j cap means along that direction for negative x this is that direction for <coughs> x is 0 x is 0 y is y i cap that means along that direction and minus for minus direction at that point if you take this one one so i cap along that minus j cap so resultant will be that uh, for that point i is positive a x is x is positive that is minus j cap and y is negative that is minus i cap so along that direction similarly at that point that direction at that point that direction okay so you can say this is a rotational or the <coughs> rotate field rotate rotated field okay previous one was the outward field this is like a rotate field so compute the divergence of this vector if we find the divergence divergence of b is nothing but del del x of coefficient of 
i that's y plus del del y of coefficient of j which is x so this will be zero divergence of b is zero means solenoidal solenoidal so not source not sink is conserve the flow it conserve the conserve conserve the flow so it conserve the flow what is the value of curl of b curl of b is nothing but i cap j cap k cap del del x del del y del del z and b vector is nothing but y minus x zero uh, del del y of zero is zero there is zero plus j cap del del z of zero and this is zero and plus k cap del del s of this minus one and minus of one so this is minus two k cap so you can also see this is a rotational and this rotational give you this is x axis and y axis this rotation happen uh, from thumb rule you can say this is along the minus k cap and this also get so uh, from this this is not equal to zero so you can say this is a uh, rotational rotation rotational rotational vector okay and you also can see from figure this vector is rotational right uh, okay uh, this okay and this is the divergence zero is solenoidal that's mean the total flow is conserved that's mean inflow is equals to outflow inflow inflow equals to outflow right so that's it thank you this is all about me this is my contact details you can contact with my whatsapp number for querying any physics related question and this is my youtube channel details go to the youtube channel and see the all the videos uh, uh total videos are there and share this video to your friends subscribe this channel if you new in this channel and press the bell icon to get the notification of uploaded recent uploaders or if when i uploaded the video you get the notification okay thank you take care we will meet in the next video as soon as possible